Hi everyone, here's a quick update on my aquaponics system. Um, a couple of things have moved uh, forward really well and the dirt plants are doing are going to be harvested of tomatoes in just a little bit. So I'll give you all a quick look of what I've done. Um, first, I've taken off the sponge gourd. It's free from on top and I've taken off a lot of the other plants. So take a look at them. This is uh, what's left of the sponge gourd creeper. So yeah, it had a little, it had a couple of flowering heads there and there's one more hidden somewhere right here that um, no, I didn't take care of. One thing that I did, I didn't spend a lot of time taking roots out. This is just the amount of roots of the sponge gourd that I pulled out. There's a huge um, piece of roots in there that I left out. I pulled out the oregano. Uh, it had shot right back up again right, even after I uh, um, even after I trimmed it a few days ago, even this, I got a bit of the root system out, but um, I didn't get it all. I think there's still a, no, it's very thick root system. This is going all over into my siphon and everything as well. And I also pulled out the Thai basil. Again, it's got roots that are still in the system. I think I'll take some of this off and try to make, uh, try to make pesto with it or something. Let's see. Also took out uh, the peas over here they weren't going anywhere so I just pulled them out and I did a bit of a trim on the red cabbage I took out the poor looking leaves I've also chucked in these they as you can see it says safety vegetables actually um, lemon grass which I planted in its place and here it is I just chucked it straight in there now the sweet basil even from the last update which was just four days ago you can see it's taken up a bit of height and it's gone quite uh, happy on all fronts the sweet basil nice and high except for this one plant that's way down there I think it's not getting enough sun the lettuces uh, are shooting up here <clears throat> they're coming along nicely still the berry plant doing very nice absolutely new stem that's coming out here and this is the original stem back here and here is the red cabbage though this is also getting a bit munched on by a grasshopper I've seen him a couple of times Coming out here is another piece of the lemongrass that I put in a separate place just to look. Stalled lemon tree. And here are the tomatoes which I figure are cherry tomatoes. One, two, three, four, five, six coming out so far. There's a seventh one in here that I can see coming out. And an eighth one in here. So yeah, plenty of tomatoes getting done on uh, this as well. <coughs> the fish doing fine. They've been given a bit of uh, new feed. Today uh, that was made out of beef heart and livers. I think they seem to like it. They're going to get a little bit more of it before I'm done with them. Otherwise the tank looks just fine. I've been messing about with the flow right now. So I've been checking uh, whether or not the siphon will work properly. Here is the sump tank looking fine as always. Here's a new exciting bit. I haven't set it up properly yet. I want to make this cover a bit more solid. But here is the bathtub. Uh, well it's under there. I'll show you right now. Uh, that had been lying there for ever so long that I hadn't used and I've set it up as a little pond. There's one pump, filter pump in the corner and there's another filter pump in the corner up there. There's an air stone and you really can't make it out but there's 24, supposedly 24 little goldfish in here that are trying to call it home. And hopefully once I get the cover made a little bit better, I'll give you guys a good look at it. And I'm going to take like 10 liters of water out of this every day and feed it into my dirt plants. Here's my mummy who's helping me um, take off the tomatoes. Now there's a couple of tomatoes that I think are ripe here. You all have seen all of them, so I'm just going to show you the ripe ones. This one I think is ripe and this one, this one is ripe. This one is ripe and the big ones that I haven't taken a look at yet today all of them are ah, here we go these are some nice ripe tomatoes and these ones in here so they're gonna get picked and photographed in just a moment yeah i think this is you say you know mama these are ripe these now. are ripe and these two are ripe okay so we're gonna get some five six tomatoes out of this right now and i'm gonna have some sandwiches yeah mama go for it I'm going to have some sandwiches with some nice fresh tomatoes, get some coriander from downstairs as well. Really big, really nice tommies coming along all over the place. Roses also coming along, these little flowers have perked up. Sponge gods here are out of action though. And uh, yeah, the rest of the radishes are still coming along. These uh, chilies that I've had for ever so long are still coming as are the red cabbages. 
and they see mummy says there's a capsicum here yes. somewhere yes. let's take a look and there we go there's a little capsicum right here then mm -hmm. and uh, there are quite a few other flowers so hopefully they'll settle in as well so yeah those are the big changes in my aquaponics and some more peas that are setting here that will get harvested in a little bit um, let me know if you guys think this is too little plant matter I've got to make sure I do a test today and tomorrow on both the systems so thanks for watching you guys take care